Well, I'm working in the field of uh, medical technology for 40 years now. <laughs> uh, and uh, it is one of the most uh, rewarding experiences uh, because when you design a device or a technology that saves human lives, you feel an immediate uh, reward that is quite uncomparable to anything else. Medical imaging is one of the most important advances in medicine. X-rays, ultrasound, uh, MRI, computer tomography, pretty much without medical imaging, advanced medicine does not exist. One day I decided to check the reports of the World Health Organization and I found out that three quarters of the world population does not have access to medical imaging. So it occurred to me that instead of just a developing new and advanced medical imaging, I would be serving humanity and society much more by developing advanced medical imaging that is accessible to everyone around the world. The technology that we have developed employs a, a very simple device with a component that is being attached to the patient. Uh, that component can be an ultrasound transducer or perhaps an x-ray machine, but in our case it is a very simple electrical impedance tomography device. Uh, what the device does, it measures electrical information from the patient and it conveys the information through the cellular phone. This is a simple cellular phone that transfers information the same way that you would transfer a text message. Uh, this information is being transferred through a central processing system, through a very powerful computer, and then we get back the image on the cellular phone. So in the remote area of the world where there is no medical imaging, the physician needs to bring just this box, their own cellular phone, and they will have medical imaging. There is not sufficient interest in developing these uh, technologies or developing advanced technologies for the entire world population. And this is why we have decided to focus now primarily on developing these advanced technologies for everyone.